Happy 4th of July. Let's make a red, white, and blue recipe today that is gluten-free, easy to make, and super fun to share. Stay tuned. Hi there, my name is Katrina. Welcome to the Organics channel, where we gather together each week in the kitchen and we celebrate healthy living through healthy recipes. Today, we're going to be making 4th of July almond flour muffins. Let's begin today by adding three eggs to a large mixing bowl. I always try to use free range if possible. Next, I have one third of a cup of your preferred liquid sweetener. I'm using honey, one third of a cup of either melted coconut oil, butter, or ghee, one quarter of a cup of your favorite dairy or unsweetened non-dairy milk, the zest of one organic lemon, which is about one tablespoon worth, along with two tablespoons of lemon juice. Last, I have one tablespoon of pure vanilla extract. Whisk together all of your wet ingredients and then set it aside. Now for our dry ingredients. To a medium-sized mixing bowl, add in two and a half cups of almond flour, a wonderful high-protein, gluten-free flour, two teaspoons of baking powder, along with one quarter teaspoon of either pink Himalayan or sea salt. Whisk together your dry ingredients. And now we're going to take a pinch of your flour and sprinkle it onto one half of a cup of chopped up strawberries, and one half a cup of blueberries. Gently coat to help the fruit from sinking to the bottom of the muffins. Now we're ready to add the dry ingredients to your wet ingredients. Fold everything together. Last, add your fruit and gently toss everything together. You'll notice your batter is a little bit thin, but it will thicken up in just a few minutes. Into greased or paper lined muffin tins, divide out the batter evenly. Now we're ready to bake in a 350 degree preheated oven for about 20 minutes or until a toothpick comes out clean when inserted in the middle. Allow your muffins to cool completely before serving. So a fun idea is to top your muffins with either coconut cream or whipping cream, along with additional fresh blueberries and chopped up strawberries. These almond flour muffins are ready for a taste. I put some coconut cream, strawberries, and fresh blueberries on top. It looks so good, so fresh. Wow, that is so good. I definitely recommend adding some kind of cream on top and then the fresh fruit. It just makes it so light, so fun, so colorful. The uh, muffins are super moist. They're definitely sweet. You actually could almost reduce the sweetness a little bit if you wanted to, but these are so good. Give them a try. Thanks so much for being with me today. Hey, celebrate your freedoms this week by choosing healthy foods. I look forward to seeing you next week in the kitchen. Bye-bye.